Hey guys, and welcome back to Fallout 4. Last episode, we acquired Hancock. And I mentioned I regretted taking the uh, Lone Wanderer perk, even though it gives me a little more carry weight, a little more damage resistance. It's not something that I'm super happy with having anymore because it means um, losing out on taking companions. But we're going to take Hancock with us anyway. The other problem is that currently I am addicted to Psycho Buff Out in Fury. <laughs> uh, which quite badly nerfs us, so we lose 3 strength, 1 endurance, 1 perception, and minus 10 damage resistance. So we need to get rid of that before we continue on, and I was going to go to Diamond City, but then I remembered, uh, they hate me. There is a way to make um, cities and stuff stop hating you, and we're going to go do that right now. We're going to go to our castle, and we are going to sleep for four in-game days. Always wanted my own fortress. So if we come over this way, and I will go to sleep for four in-game days. 24, please. Sleep for 24 hours. I'll be back. And four days later, we should be alright, actually. Oh, something's happening at the castle. <laughs> and I can hear Strong in his minigun. Well, whoever that was, they're dead. No, they're not dead. They're up there somewhere, though. We'll have to go find out what that was. And I am overburdened, and that is probably because of my lack of strength right now. Oh, by the way, um, a whole bunch of changes has happened to the castle. <laughs> I don't think I've actually shown you guys before. Uh, made like a little bar here. This is actually like a bar stand, as you can see. Um, and this is like a, uh, a, sleep, a communal sleeping area. And I'll show you the rest once I'm not overburdened. Although, I am actually wondering why I'm so badly overburdened. Because apparently I didn't have any junk on me. I have some power armor stuff on me, that might be why. Let's drop that off. The fan's yes. not much. That'll certainly get me underweight. Get out of here. I'm not wearing you or you, so you can go in. Good, good. So what are you shooting at, Strong? Right, and this is I don't this is a bathroom, communal bathroom. It's pretty cool. <laughs> and this is where um, Preston Gavi now lives. He lives in here. He lives next to the bathroom. Why? I don't know. Okay, you guys were shooting at a raider who managed to get up on the wall. I don't know how you managed to do that raider because there's no way in. Sometimes there is some weird spawning stuff going on. Yeah. Yeah, so we need to wait till daytime. Reason being is I need to talk to the doctor. These guys are all hanging out at the bar. So this is a feature that not many people know about. If you have a bar and you have seating around the bar, settlers will gather here when they're not doing anything. But we are going to sit in this chair so that I can wait. They've been... 12 and 7. So we'll get up at 7 in the morning. Well, it'll be 7.30. Beast was weak, leader. Strong glad to be rid of him. Yes, I gave uh, Strong some sweet armor and a minigun. So he is guard number one of this place. He is actually on guard duty, which is fun. Doctor, are you in? We're not in yet. Hurry up. Waiting on you, buddy. Right. Excuse me. I can patch you up if you need it. For a small fee, of course. I 
could. Yeah. Take a look at me, Doc. Tell me your symptoms. I love my glasses. They are so great. I need you I've to cure my addictions. Stuff. Too many chems. Got anything that can help? Yeah, you got it bad. Let's flush your system. It's gonna burn like crazy afterwards, all right? That is the cheapest addict doll you can buy. All done. <laughs> Any other complaints? Uh, you may as well cure my rats while I'm here. All right. Let's flush your system. Done. Now, was there anything else bothering you? And you may as well heal me. Bad hits recently. Got knocked around. Ah, I've seen worse. Better stitch you up before infection sets in, though. All done. Excellent. Any other complaints? No, no, no other complaints, thank you. No, more done. Off you go then. So I think that gets rid of all of the addictions. Yes, it does. So I'm perfectly healthy now. Um, and can once again carry a ridiculous amount, although 50 points less because we have uh, Mr. Man with us. The other piece of housekeeping that I need to talk about is that yesterday, I think it was yesterday, um, the first piece of DLC came out for Fallout 4, which is Automatron, and it is all about the robots. So we might be seeing some new enemies and stuff in the wasteland. I'm not entirely sure. I haven't played any of it yet, but it is installed um, on the game currently. So... Oh, and when you when you start, you also get this mechanical menace qu uh, quest. Listen to the caravan distress call, um, which we're not going to do because we had plans. Our plan was to m go up to Salem, I think. There's also the Pikmin Gallery. I'm not sure why we wanted to do that, but we could go up to the Museum of Witchcraft. Why don't we do that? Uh, Vare Beach Station. Where do I want to go? Oh, it is cleared. Okay, so I was worried about going to the station and having to fight super mutants, which I don't particularly feel like doing. I kind of want to just go up to Salem. <laughs> right, hello, Revere Satellite. So we want to go to Salem. So we should probably head straight east, actually, and go across the bridge. Oh, hello. All right. Thanks, Hancock. At least I know you're a crack shot with that whatever you're using. What are you using? Oh, sawn off. Okay. So let's head out. Find what we can find. I can hear the Brotherhood messing about. I also heard a rocket go off. What are these guys up to? They're fighting something. Uh, and something threw a molly at me. Hello? Did they throw a molotov at me? Rude. Read Marina. I guess we can check out Reed Marina while we're here. Get some nice junk. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I'll be right back. <laughs> right, I am back. Now, the reason I uh, disappeared for a sec was that I needed to clear my inventory. Whoa, hello. D-E-D. -E no, don't even. Power armor means nothing to me, mate. Uh, book return tokens. Why does he have book return tokens? <laughs> uh, we don't need any of that stuff. Okay, let's go back to Reed Marina. I will be exploring, but I just don't want to go in the wrong direction, so... Ooh. 
Go ahead and go. go. Right. Should be good. I'll eat some food. Uh, red stag. Why not? What doggy do have? Dog armor, spiked muzzle. Yeah, I think we have all of that for dog meat right now. Let's go check out what this Reed Marina place is all about. Blood bugs, apparently. Red Widow blood bug. Alright. I'll get off. Hey, thanks, Hancock. See, Hancock's a lot more useful than a dog. <laughs> as much as I love that dog, he's not very helpful. We've got a dead robot. How do we actually get into this place? Aha. Uh -huh. Let's provide some light. Telephone. Yay. What else do we have? Got the sound of another Mr. Handy. Uh, you say that, Hancock, but there's literally a Mr. Handy through in the other room. You're more useful to me in parts than you are as a non-interactive thing. Sniper rifle we'll take so we can pull it apart. Break room note. Malcolm, would you mind not slurping your coffee? I can literally hear you on the other side of the hangar. If I didn't know any better, I'd think you were doing it on purpose. Eugene. Note number two. Eugene, everything on this counter is mine. Touch anything and you're a dead man. Malcolm. Alright, these people don't like each other. We have a magazine. Bingo. Tesla Science. Energy weapons permanently inflict 5% more critical damage. There Happy birthday, go. sweet roll. Apparently this is an important sweet roll. It has candles in it. Coca-Cola cherry. Uh, bathrooms. We have a terminal. Malcolm's Terminal. Here. Lake. Meat. Uh. Oh, come on. One of these has got a refill. There we go. <laughs> oh, there we go. That's how I normally open these terminals rather than actually trying to do the puzzle. Uh, 11 to 2077. So that's just when the bombs drop it. We just got to the marina today. It's hell outside. We should be able to fix one of these damn boats and sail ourselves out of here. My uptight brother drives me nuts sometimes, but family sticks together through thick and thin. We've got a lot of work to do. I need a cup of coffee. Day 25. After I told the pinhead off, he stopped talking to me. We must go north. That chicken shit has started leaving little notes everywhere instead. Two can play at that game. Day 45. Well, it's our birthday tomorrow. Eugene wants to bury the hatchet and I just might bury it in his back. <laughs> I know a little trick with the robot security protocols. It'll make a nice birthday gift for that bastard. He'll never see it coming. Alright, so apparently there was a trap set using birthday and... Oh, this is your bed. Using the birthday and the robots. I imagine if the robots were still alive, if I picked up that sweet roll, they would have attacked me or something. Right, other Mr. Handy. Where is Eugene's... Ah, here it is. 11 to 77. First day at the marina. Ten days since the bombs fell and the world has gone mad. Malcolm and I just might be able to pull this off. The boats are still in good condition. If we can get one of them up and running, we can escape the chaos of this war. I'm glad Malcolm is here. Family have to stick together, even if he is annoying slob that slurps his coffee. 20th day at Reeb. If that blasted fool thinks he can tell me what's what, he's got another thing coming. He needs me, and that means I say what goes. We are escaping south. That jackass is never going to fix the other boat without my expertise and parts. 
And for what? To head north, of all places? If he wasn't my own flesh and blood, I'd clobber his coffee, coffee sloping contrarian face with a wrench. I think he's doing it on purpose. He slurped his coffee for the last time. He must die. It's the only logical choice, and really he has no one to blame but himself. All I need are the parts for his boat, and I can escape this irradiated hell. I've been looking into the robot safety protocols, and I think I have a little... <laughs> Alright, so they both planned the exact same thing for each other. Hello, you. Ah, parts. I like parts. All robots must die because they are made of parts. Straw pillow. Get some clothes. Do we have anything else up here to loot? Anything in that box? Nothing. What about up here? No. Oh, it's a cap stash. What do you have? Gear, spring, wood. Good enough. Okay, so let's get out of here and keep going toward Salem. We're kind of going uh, lateral to Salem at the moment. But we'll be able to head north soon once we cross the bridge that's nearby. Here we go. Oh. Right. Bridge. Here. So. What do we find? on the bridge. My alerts! Because of course. Hey. I'm gonna be a lot more careful with um, with damage now. Not so much once I level up because I'm actually gonna invest in medic. Uh, which makes my stim packs better. But I have to be more careful just generally because Lone Wanderer gave me uh, a huge boost to my damage threshold, which I no longer have. You saw that, right? Explore. Uh, forgot how annoying these guys are. It's only been a week, and I've already forgotten. <laughs> Take a stim. Yeah, see, right now I get like a third of my health off a single stim, and that badly needs to change. Cool. But if I am going to stop being lazy about blocking, then I'm not going to take any damage from them whatsoever if I'm good enough. Question is, can I be good enough? Oh, another one. Come here. Come on. Have a explodey. Right. Ah. Strike. My turn. My turn. Sometimes Razor Claws fake you out as well. They're like, go to strike with one claw and then strike with the small one. Oh, go Hancock! Man, you deserve a jet after that. Hancock does not mind getting his hands dirty and going in with his friend, the butt of his gun. Plasma cartridges. I think I've gone on this rant before, but I would like to see fist weapons that use ammunition again. Kind of like the ballistic fist from uh, Fallout New Vegas. Oh. Legendary male alert kill claw. Well then. Hi friend. Uh. <laughs> ah, wrong key, Rosie. This thing is destroying me. Um, I'll take a queen stake. Come on. 
Them do a hurt. You scared now. We have mutated. We don't have staggering, which is nice, but you are just destroying me anyway. Come on. My Lurks just have way too much armor. That is the big problem. They wouldn't be so bad if, like, everything you did to them... Like, I wouldn't mind them having this much armor if they also had less health as a, you know, direct result. So that if you did get at their vulnerable spots, if you were diligent about hitting them in their vulnerable areas, you killed them quickly. Synth Light Armor of the Sprinter. Increased movement speed by 10%. No thank you. That was a complete waste of time. Hello? Standard kill floor. Alright. As usual, I don't have time for your shenanigans. Yeah, so like, if these guys had less health as a result of being so well armored, I'd be so much happier about fighting them. But it's like, even if you get them in the vulnerable areas, they still manage to just be a total pain. Damn right. Can't punch through that. How do we get inside here? Hello door. I see a laser. Good. Good. Shut up. I can never tell whether those actually are capable of setting off traps, but I never want to uh, try, you know? Double barrel shotgun. Good thing I took advanced. <laughs> oh, come on. No. So this character needs a couple of perks. I've, you know, like earlier on I was thinking yes. that I was getting toward the end of necessary things, but I'm totally wrong. We need Life Giver, which is pretty cool. Especially the last one, you slowly regenerate health anyway. And we also need Medic. So Stimpaks restore 40% of lost health and right away removes 40% radiation, all the way up to Stimpaks restore all lost health and radiation. So, you know, those are two perks which we desperately need, especially if the game's just going to keep getting harder. Because as much as our Furious Power Fist was a complete OP destroyer of worlds uh, when we first got it, it is very quickly becoming defunct. So how do we get across this bridge? Ah, uh, there's a car. Hello, car. Uh, hi. There we go. Good, good. Let's keep moving on towards Salem. So we're actually finally... What? That car fell off the highway. All right. Whatever. <laughs> Gotta keep going this way. No, this... This... Sort of this way. We'll check what this is all about while we're here. We're off the beach, so there shouldn't be any more Milex, right? Oh, there's water though, so. That is it, Hancock. Oh. Hello, iBot. Hello, Spear Pats. Nice. Oh, hello, what? Something's coming. Oh. Huh. 
Alright, can okay, get up that way. Let's go up the proper way then. We have nothing of interest up here. I'm guessing the loot for this place is down here in the water. Yeah. That is totally useless. Anything else? Oh, this place is just kind of a waste. Alright, moving right along. <laughs> go, go, go. I have so much AP here. It's great. It's great. I can sprint forever. Well, not forever, but for a very long time, comparatively. Thanks, endurance. So, what's this place? This is... Just wondering whether we should bother to stop off here. Long Nick Lukowski's cannery. No, we will not be going there. That's the place with the gross potted meat when I met that guy way in the beginning of the series. Might go there sometime, but not today. We'll just keep continuing north. While I'm at it, I think I'll quick save. <laughs> just realized I've come quite a ways away and have not saved. What's this one though? We have... Ah, oh, it's toilets. Somebody is living in a toilet block. Fair enough. I get the good neighbor lifestyle ain't for everyone, but it beats the alternatives. Folks in a place like Diamond City wouldn't give a ghoul... So, I mean, this place, like, it's too interesting, right? It has a lighthouse. Distracted. What? Child of Athen Preacher. Yeah, that was painful. Um, that's what I get for not actually wearing... Uh, power armor when fighting someone with a... Gamma gun. I need to get behind cover. Oh my god. Gamma guns are really powerful against people. Uh, I mean, I already took red X, but <laughs> more red X just to make sure. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, no. I was being knocked around there, and I'm not sure why. Oh! Oh, you stop knocking me around! Oh my god, this is just like... Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Stop it. Stop it and also die. Ooh. Yeah. Wow. Gamma guns are apparently my uh, ante. Oh my god, there's more of you? And you're all preachers. Preacher convention. Stop. 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 Oh. My god. Okay. Uh, get more right away. I don't think medics would have helped there. I really don't.
Hancock's fine, he's a ghoul. Ah, oh, this is a this is a settlement. Child of Atom reborn. Okay. Is that like a super preacher? Look, buddy. No. Stop. Stop it. Oh, someone with a normal gun. Still hurts, but at least it's not like death incarnate for me. Ah. No, don't. F uh. <sighs> There's more? Why is there more? There's a glowing one. There's, they've got a glowing one in a lighthouse. Alright, we'll come deal with you. I want to deal with the person down there first. Okay. Every year shall be stricken death to hear the thunder of his voice. Oh, shush. Stop with the game. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. Gamma. Guns. Oh, my God. What are you shooting at? Oh, there's a guy on the boat. You know what? I'm grumpy. Yeah, this still is not doing a particularly great job with the damage. last of them apart from the glowing one up in the lighthouse. Nice. Yeah, need to find a uh, better way of dealing with these guys in the future. I used up a lot of resources because of that. <laughs> a lot of resources I was trying to save as well. I'm running low on everything. Okay, that's good. Didn't miss anything interesting in here? Not really, huh? Radioactive barrels, let's keep moving. I loot you, I did. And back up the lighthouse. And we'll check out the house after we've dealt with the glowing one. Okay, you were hitting me with a pipe rifle. Come on, Hancock. We've got a glowing one to deal with. And honestly, it might be quite difficult. So... Save scum. Oh my god. Good, good, good. Calibrated combat rifle, powerful ported. Uh, yeah, we can tear it apart. Okay. Food. Well, actually... No. Right away. Place 
and it's a queen like snake. Hiding something. Normally right there with you, Hancock, but I think this place is pretty much... Yeah, we now own this place, that's nice. We have a weapons workbench. What's in the house? What did we leave in the house? A safe. That's it. And not a heck of a lot else. Oh, light bulb and a terminal. The beacon. We have been charged by our brothers and sisters at the. Ch at the crater, nearly said charter, to lead others back to the glow. We have brought in those those strong with Adam's blessing to provide a beacon at the top of this tower. Their light shall draw the believers, the faithful should pray at the tower, then continue their pilgrimage to the crater. Praise be to Adam. Heretics. It would seem that the beacon has also drawn heretics who must be shown the glory of Adam. Those who will not join us must be cleansed. Then we may use them to feed the blessed in the tower. All glory to Atom. Wow. They crazy. So, they stuck a glowing one in there to act as a beacon. And they fed it using people who didn't agree with them. Alright, well, um, I think we'll have to leave it here, guys. Next episode, we're going to head this way. Uh, along to Salem, which is looking like it's pretty close, actually. So, thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.